Hey, it's Tesla Canuck. I did a video earlier this week about the new release 2020.28.5, and I noticed that the Tesla, like my Model 3, was really hugging the left-hand side of the lane on a two-lane highway. Now, of course, for anyone in the UK or in Australia or Japan, I mean, that's gonna be the right side. But the point being, it's kind of uncomfortable when your vehicle is hugging uh, the lane the, uh, the side of the lane that oncoming traffic is coming from. So anyhow, I you know, posted the video and there was a lot of comments. Some people felt it might be an optical illusion. Some people felt that, yeah, you know, I do notice the same thing. So I wanted to really take a scientific approach to this and figure out once and for all, does Tesla Autopilot favor the left side of the lane? In order to prove once and for all whether or not Tesla Autopilot is favoring the left side of the lane on a two-lane highway or in the city or the freeway, I'm going to test all three of these possibilities. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm mounting a couple of GoPros, so I've got one there, and I'm currently filming with the other one, but it's going to go over here on this side. And we're going to have a high-resolution, uh, stable view of what is happening with the car and whether or not it is uh, hugging that left-hand side of the lane. And also I'm gonna have a camera inside the car. So we'll have three cameras going and we're going to prove definitively what is going on. All right, so first up in this segment, we are going to uh, take a look at the in the city, sort of uh, speaking. I mean, I live in the country, but this is about city as you're gonna get uh, to see whether or not the Model 3 is going to hug the left-hand side of the lane. So remember, this is test number one. We're also going to take a look at two-lane highway, and also we're going to take a look at the uh, freeway. And I'm not going to know the results until uh, I produce the video. I mean, it feels like it's hugging the left-hand side of the lane, but um, I'm not sure. It could be in the city that it's trying to avoid maybe cars parked on the side. Um, but yeah, it certainly feels like it is hugging left. Let's go through these lights here and then we're going to do one more segment. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> All right, let me put that back into autopilot. And uh, let's see what it does here. It's a long weekend, so I don't know. Uh, the test along this stretch is probably not going to be very good. But uh, this actually is interesting that this happened. I mean, there's a huge traffic jam here. With the cars in front of it like this, I can feel that it's probably centered in the lane. I mean, it's doing something funky in the graphic because there are two lines uh, on the road, but I feel kind of centered here. Okay, that's it for the city test. All right, on this segment here, this is a two lane highway, obviously. <laughs> and um, we've got the GoPros going, we're going to see a high resolution footage. We'll be able to see exactly what's happening on a two lane highway. We have the autopilot on, and hopefully, we'll get some oncoming traffic and we'll see whether or not the car is centered in the lane or if it is indeed favoring the left side of the lane on a two, two lane highway. I can tell you it feels like. <laughs> It's um, hugging the left side of the lane. That, that truck, that was very uncomfortable. <laughs> okay, now it, it seemed to have, after the truck, it seemed to have moved a little bit into the center. I, I'm not sure what's going on here. It does seem that when we pass cars, that it is edging closer towards the um, left-hand side of the lane 
Of course, that's the oncoming traffic light. Now it's centered, it feels like. And it felt like it, it moved closer as the cars were approaching. Someone who posted to my last video when I mentioned that I kind of felt uh, that this was happening, they said that, uh, well, it, was, it could be an optical illusion, but also that autopilot and the neural net may be um, relying less on the lines and more on what it sees. Now, I mean, that's interesting if that is going on. Obviously, it's not perfected because once it starts relying on what it sees, you know, autopilot that is, then I would expect to do what we normally do as, as human beings who uh, are driving is on a two-lane highway, we would tend to favor the right-hand side um, or the side that's not, you know, oncoming traffic. All right, so that's it for the two-lane highway uh, test. I'm not gonna know the results until I produce the video and, and see what the GoPros are seeing. Um, and also, too, I'm gonna put a center line um, in the video to see if that helps kind of gauge what the car is doing. But that's it for the two-lane highway portion. Uh, next up, we're going to do the freeway, and you know, we'll see if there's any difference. In this next segment, we're on a multi-lane freeway, obviously, <laughs> uh, to see where in the lane we're going to uh, be placed. And um, again, I mean, it feels like I am hugging the left side of the lane. And I'm gonna slow down a little bit here to uh, get some cars to pass me. And uh, we'll see if there's any change in the car's behavior uh, when there's a vehicle passing. Slow down a little bit more. The graphic pretty much shows us being in the middle of the lane. It does feel though that I am closer to the left. And again, I mean, it could be just an optical illusion, a feeling. And uh, once again, I'm not going to know until I edit the video uh, what is actually happening. So, um, a little bit of suspense for you. <laughs> Alright, I think we have enough data here that we've collected. So, we'll call this segment a wrap. And I'm going to have to, as I mentioned, I'm going to have to edit this video and then shoot the conclusion because I don't know what the result is yet. Well, that was really interesting. That's the first video I've ever done where I don't know the result until I edit the video. So call me surprised, call me shocked, and call me wrong, dead wrong. I couldn't be more wrong. <laughs> I, I think the evidence is pretty clear that the Tesla Model 3 on autopilot stays centered in the lane. And I think this whole feeling of the car hugging the left-hand side, or the right, if you're right-hand drive car, is just absolutely an illusion. It's an optical illusion. Uh, it's just a feeling, but the evidence says the car is in the center of the, of the lane. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Hit that subscribe button. Tesla Canuck, over and out.